Hi Tom, welcome to the EAA uh, Oshkosh demonstration for Tom's Aviation. So we're going to talk a little bit about the G2000, the Garmin G2000 integrated avionics platform. So we have a dual screen system, primary flight display on the left hand side, multi-function display on the right hand side, all your engine indications, we have flexible charts and maps that you can set up on the multi-function display. One of the great things and new uh, innovations that Garmin's brought to the uh, our G2000 is the touchscreen controller. So instead of traditional FMS controllers that are all push buttons, we've now migrated to this nice touchscreen uh, product here. And that's in line with uh, Garmin's philosophy uh, now of uh, touchscreen avionics. We have retrofit products. And now this is for a um, Part 23 um, category aeroplane. Um, so we have all your comm controls on the left hand side, uh, comm 1, comm 2, active and standby frequency. And this controls most of the avionics now for the uh, primary flight display and the multifunction display. Um, so the philosophy for, for, the, for the Garmin system is a, all of the control is done through this touchscreen system and that controls exactly what you see up on the, uh, on the screens here. We also have the autopilot controller, so this is Garmin's GFC 700 award winning autopilot. Um, all the autopilot controls just up here um, with the backup nav um, and flight planning system just in case the controller um, fails. So some great features that we have with the G2000, which is common across many of the Garmin platforms now, is our synthetic vision system. Uh, so we have a synthetic terrain and a, a means of uh, a highway in the sky, so flying straight through those uh, boxes on your flight plan. We have your uh, autopilot information right there on the uh, uh, on the top. You can, uh, you should be able to engage the autopilot in heading mode there. So moving over to the um, multi-function display, we have the ability to display flexible information so you can put your moving map display and then you can put your charts, um, load up your charts on one side, you have your traffic information and you have the engine indication system that always remains on the, on the page here with your, your various waypoint information there. So this is the uh, this is the configuration that's currently going to be installed in the uh, Cessna TTX, which is the new uh, high-end single-engine piston aircraft from, from Cessna. Um, this configuration, as you see here today.